Hi, in this tutorial, I will show you how to backup and restore Elasticsearch Index using Amazon S3. In order to easy backup and restore with S3, you will add S3 repository plugin using this command and make sure you restart uh, Elasticsearch service after installing plugin. After restarting Elasticsearch, you will use this curl command to register your S3 with Elasticsearch. Make sure you have S3 access key, secret key, and bucket name and region before running this command. If you don't know, please ask your DevOps or AWS operator. You can download the curl command from my GitHub URL below. You already know backup should be running every day. You better have this cron tab in your etc cron.d directory to run backup every day. This also can be downloaded from the GitHub. Here is the backup script which is triggered by cron tab. Let's suppose we backup every midnight. We, need, we will need yesterday index date to backup yesterday index. We define prefixes for indexes. If you only have a Tomcat server in your cloud, you will just have Tomcat dash in index prefix. Now we store each index to S3. For example, Tomcat dash 2017.08.06 snapshot is one backup for Tomcat on 6th of August. This script is also can be downloaded from my GitHub below. So, let's check out if backup is made successfully. So, this is the command to check the snapshots. And as you can see, we have one snapshot here. Snapshot name Tomcat 2017 August 6 snapshot. And this one has the index here. So as you can see, the backup successfully made here. So, okay, let's see the Kibana. So this is my Kibana and should have some data from my Tomcat server. You can see there is a Tomcat log file in the Kibana. So since the backup is successfully done, let's test our restore script. So before testing restore script, since we have backup, let's delete this index from the Elasticsearch. So I'm going to delete this index from Elasticsearch now. And it's deleted. And let me reload here, Kibana. Since we deleted the index, this Kibana should not have any data here. As you can see, there's no data here. But don't worry. I'm going to use the backup data to restore this log file. So what I'm going to do here, I'm going to run my restore script. Here is my restore script, at restore.sh, and I'm going to give the argument command, command argument here, uh, the tomcat-2017-0806, which I want to restore now. Looks like it worked well. So I'm going to go back to the Kibana here and see if the log is restored or not. See, the data is now here. That means we successfully restored our log data from the S3 backup. So let me go to my PowerPoint again back here. So we deleted the index for restore practice and restored using this command. And uh, let's see the restore script here. First, I'm getting the command argument which I want to restore. And uh, the argument is the index name. I'm just getting this snapshot from our S3 and restore to our Elasticsearch. Okay, that's it. Thanks for watching Backup and Restore with S3 for the Elasticsearch. I will see you on the next video. Thank you.